When did y'all do that song, man? That one that everybody loved, man. Oh, yeah. yeah, man. In the back seat of a cottage, chop it up, do it was seven double L E M. Uh, man, it was a man B lo <laughs> One day walking into my mom's house. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. <laughs> That's so true. so you basically, man, like I said, you got it. You figured it out early is what you're telling me. Yeah. You figured it out. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to commit myself to this music career. Uh -huh. And so as you're doing that, do or die, it becomes a thing where people, when did y'all do that song, man, that one that everybody loved, man? Oh, yeah, man. In the backseat of a cottage, chop it up, do it was. Seven double L, we in, fly love to them laughing to be in. Uh. Man, it was a man B Lo <laughs> one day walking into my mom's house. Man, me and B Lo sat down for a minute because we had just got through jogging. I picked up a tape, put it in the radio, played it, said this 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 no this old school to my radio. You ain't tape gotta tape. tell me, you know hey, to the tape pop. <laughs> yeah, to the tape pop. <laughs> right. Push that play and a song came on called Miz. Okay. Uh David Oliver. I said, man, be like, we, we probably need to get the tracks to replay this. So we take it to the studio, have tracks to replay it. Uh, we start coming up with the hook. As we coming up with the hook, we was like, man, we need somebody to sing this. My childhood friend, Johnny P, who's singing on the hook of uh, Pope Pimp, um, one, of, one of our mutual friends go say, man, we, we finna go get this singer. Now, we don't even know it's Johnny. Okay. So we going to get this singer. I'm like, man, I hope this nigga can sing. Can sing. And we get that Johnny walk out. I said, oh, man. I said, dude, this is my childhood friend. Yeah. <laughs> he said, yeah. I said, yeah. Johnny get in there. He sing. <laughs> so what happened next day? We go downstairs. Uh, we were going to the flea market, a place called Flea Market. We going downstairs. Twister coming up, and I see him. I said, Twister, man, I want, I want you to get on this song. He said, what song? I said, it's, it's called Pope Pimp. He said, send it to me, man. I get on it. Send it to him. Yeah. Put it on the How did he send? How did he? Oh, that. How, how did he send it? Huh? He said. He said, send it to me. Meaning, meaning, you know, you can't send it. That's what I'm trying to ask you. Are you saying send it to him as giving send him a tape? A mail it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mail it, nigga. Yeah. 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 Hand it to me, yeah. man. Get yeah. it to me. Yeah. Get it to me. And we gonna get it done. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> so as, well, that's what he meant by send it to him. You know, back then ain't want no email. No, it was none of that. Man, he got it. Man, he wrote his verse. We got up, he jumped in the truck, he, he said his verse to us. I was like, damn. And he was like, man, I need like three or four more bars. He was like, I said, well, just say P-O-P-I-M-P. All of them, he said, he said, I'm finished. I said, let's go. Man, he really did lay this verse. Well, a younger brother might be having hope for grip, and they collecting no dope and tips, but I be spitting more games than a mouth full of poker chips to get them ladies with the open lips. And the next thing you know, man, I went, I took Twist to go get his last check, and Got my mom's out of her car that she was driving for like four years. So supposed to get the last check where? Um, from the job he was working at the time. He was working. Oh, Pope Pimp, no. Yeah, he was no, working. Yeah. Where was he working? Do you remember? I don't remember, but mm. it was in the suburbs. It was in the suburbs. You I took him over that old work. factory yeah. building yeah. somewhere. Nigga, no, no sign check. on it. Yeah. Just a <laughs> yeah, I took him over his last check, man. And he walked back out of there like it's up. It's, it's up. Home. Yeah, and it's been on ever since. That's, that's huge. That, that's what God do, man. That's beautiful, yeah. bro. Yeah. So, so when you when did when did when did that first time you heard it on the radio that old jumping too? Cause that old coming ever since day oh, one. Mixed and mastered. Mixed and mastered. Mixed Look and at master. my wife, yeah. nigga. Mixed and mastered. You Mixed and <laughs> she owned it, man. <laughs> Look, it, the crazy. Now here's the crazy part. The radio station in Chicago didn't want to play it. They didn't want to play it. They didn't want to play it. Why? Period. Hating on the hating on the real players. Yeah, exactly. Hating on some so, youngsters trying to come up. Um. So happy, we get with rap a lot. Jay Prince, uh, and Jay, at this time, Jay Prince was over at Virgin. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And the, they so smart, they was being so smart over at Virgin, they said, man, look, this is what we gonna do. We're not gonna give w, you know, the radio station, I don't even say the name, said the radio station, we're not gonna give them the rights to Janet Jackson if they don't play Pope Pimp. What a strategy to use. Wait. What a strategy to use. And sure enough, 
I'm riding Roosevelt coming coming across the bridge, and I hear Bill, do you wanna ride? But I'm saying to myself, man, why I got this tape in? I'm thinking it's the tape. You think it's the tape? Yeah. <laughs> I look down. It's, it's the radio. Ooh. Once again, that was that was reassurance that God said, "I said I'm gonna do what I said I'm gonna do, do. It. and it's gonna do." So, how, you don't just meet Jay Prince. How do y'all have ties to get to Jay Prince at that time? Did y'all know him? Because I know Chicago loved Jay Prince and embraced the Ghetto Boys. Yeah. How did y'all? How did y'all link with him? How did y'all? You know, make that connection. So, <laughs> uh, a show. Okay. Fifth Ward Juvenile Boys. Fifth Ward. Uh, doing, doing a show. Uh, I grabbed my mom's car. This this in the beginning of it. Grab my mom's car. We get in my mom's car. Shoot over to the place. Nobody in it. So, Fifth Ward Juvenile Boys it, you know, didn't pack the place. Nobody in it. But still ain't yet. I said, if, if we, I told the group, if we finna perform, let's perform like there's a million of people in here. That's what we did. Got on stage, performed like it was a million of people in the place. As we performed, Carlton Joshua from Rap a Lot handed us a card. Wow. Say here. Looked at the card, called him, told him to bring us down. Wow. We was going, we went back and forth with Rap a Lot probably like three times. The fourth time, they had to come find us with Pope Pimp. They had to come see, they had to come get you. With God reinsuring. Wow, that was just God reassuring. What, what was the conversation like when they when they said they wanted y'all to sign? You talked to Jay or did we y'all straight to Jay? Yeah, we talked straight to Jay. And Jay said, "Man, we want y'all to come join the Rap a Lot yeah. family." Yeah, he didn't say it like that. Jay said, "Yeah, I want y'all to yeah. come yeah. join the Rap a Lot family." I already know what it is, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, y'all got the album, we got the hits. Let's do it, man. You know that's how that's it hard, man. <laughs> so, so you know, how did y'all feel? Y'all was excited. Oh man, Paz excited because you had the ghetto boys. That's the, it, boy. Scarface, like Ooh. man, and and just to see Face listening to all Face music and then being able to be a, a label mate. Man, come on, oh, man, that's a that's that's a, that's a cat dream, man. So, but that was just you and or, and your bro. It was you. It was just y'all three. Just us three. Yeah. Twister, he was already signed. Twister signed over to uh, Seawall. Uh, he did some, uh, with the company that we was dealing with with Pope Pimp. Yeah, he signed over to them. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. And man, you know that's crazy. Did y'all ever come back together? Uh, yeah. To do you know to yeah. collect? Cause yeah. that was yeah. such a big song. Yeah. We work. We actually working right now. Us and Twitter. Awesome. Right now. Really? Yeah, I got a new album out called Swimming with Sharks. Twister. You and who? Uh, me and Twister. We working right now. Really? Yeah. I got a solo album out right now called. I uh, seen Swimming that. Sharks. Yeah. So he on two of the joints. Got two videos with it. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.